Okay. What's going on, people? Welcome to another vlog. This is vlog 100 and... Don't remember, but that's okay because... Well, when senility hits, you just run with it. You just roll with it. Fuck it. Why not? Uh, my name is Messiah. Welcome to the vlog. Uh, I am called the Hoodie Vlogger or the Realist Vlogger on YouTube. That's right. Who gave me those monikers? Mm, I don't know. Who did that? I don't know. Anyway, um, I'm in my hotel once again. The, it's the end of the work day. I didn't vlog waking up and yada 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 because be really honest. I kind of woke up slightly late. My alarm on my phone didn't go off. That kind of is slightly upsetting. So what the fuck is that about? I have no clue. But all that aside, it's the end of the day. It's cold. I'm bald. It's cold. I'm not. Oh, I'm not kidding. It's freaking cold outside. There's snow out there. Is it snowing? No. Is it cold as hell? Yes. Do I feel like I'm being molested by the windshield? Mm-hmm. It's touching my no no square. It definitely is. Anyway, um, I'm going to change out of my regular work clothes, aka uniform, and I'm changing into my regular clothes that you've already seen because I only brought one pair of clothes, whatever. And I'm going to take you guys somewhere that is absolutely magical. We are on the way. That's right. We're going to this magical place. I'm going to take you guys with me. It's going to be awesome. I'm going there for dinner. This will be the second time. I went there yesterday, but I was too tired to vlog. And frankly, I have way too much footage to go through. Um, as we speak, yesterday's travel vlog, I get to... Uh, oh, so cold. Yep. I've yet to edit because holy crap, it's a lot. So uh, I'll do the best I can with that. But right now we're gonna head to the car, which obviously you see me doing, so that I can take you guys with me. Oh, you know, I want to sit here and say, oh man, I'll never complain about Colorado cold again. But you know what? I'm gonna complain about the Colorado cold. Like I'm gonna complain about this cold because frankly, I don't do cold. It's freezing. Look at this snow. This is more snow that's in the springs right now. Look at this. This is ridiculous. Holy crap. All right, we are officially here and I'm fixing my pants. I, this place is fucking magical. Uh, it's absolutely magical. You guys want to know what it is? I'm going to show you what it is. Right there. That's right. Portillo's. Best Italian beef sandwiches anywhere. I love this place. I fell in love with it uh, back in Cali. It, um, I live in a, a little city called Buena Park. And uh, there was this restaurant called Portillo's over by the Buena Park Mall and I thought what the hell is this so when I went up there holy crap I fell in love I love this place this place is fucking amazing every time I come around I order the exact same thing or uh, one of their hot dogs it's it man I can't help it I love this place let's go inside come on yeah Look how this restaurant looks. Hello. You hear that music in the background? I love this place. This place is absolutely amazing. This is a different one than what I went to uh, yesterday. The one I went to yesterday had uh, revolving doors. They got a jukebox. They got a freaking Dollars to donuts, this thing still probably works. Look at that. You see that? La Bamba by Richie Valens. Run around Sue. Fr wow, old school. This is right here, this is it. I absolutely love this place. I'm not joking. 
Portillo's has been my restaurant since I discovered it in Cali. I love this place. That's awesome. I want to drive that. Hi! Sorry, I'm vlogging because I love this place. I love this place. I know exactly what I want to order. Uh, I would like the Italian beef dipped. Yeah. And um, can I have that with the uh, the, uh, the jalapenos or whatever you guys? Yes, hot peppers. And can I have a side of onion rings? And a very, very, very large Arnold Palmer. Uh, um, no, not now. Not yet. I always get this. Alright, so this is right there is where they make everything, right over there, right? Um, all the fresh condiments and whatnot, freaking delicious. And um, this is where you pick up your order, obviously, but. Yeah, they are uh, old school with the kangles and everything. Bar, old school tables. I love this place. I don't know, it's just something about it. The food, the environment, the whole nine yards. It's awesome. And what I just ordered is what I literally order every single time. You see this right here? Italian beef, spicy. Onion rings, a little bit of ketchup, and a really big Arnold Palmer. This meal, I will smash. Okay, so, uh, yeah, I demolished that damn meal, straight up. That was, oh uh, man. I'm good for the night, shit. I mean, I'm not going to sleep anytime soon, but I'm, I'm basically golden. Huh. Look at this. See? You see that, that long line of cars right there? All that right there, that's for the folks that are getting in line. There's even people, look, I'm parked, where I'm parked, there's people in line behind me trying to get out. Straight up. I'm really good, I, mean, <laughs> I said that wrong. Where I'm parked, there's people behind me uh, waiting in line to uh, order their Portillo's. Good people, that was Portillo's. Hopefully you can hear me because I know the wind's starting to pick up a little bit. But that's the magical place I want to take you. Why is it magical, you ask? That's easy. One, the food is great. Two, the food is great. Three, the environment is awesome. Four, the food is fucking delicious. Plain and simple. They have the absolute best Italian beef sandwiches, hands down, anywhere that I've ever been to. Straight up absolute best so if you ever want to go to get an Italian beef sandwich go to Portillo's so real quick maybe it's just me I'm pretty sure it's not but can a place smell like a bad bean burrito I'm not joking I was I was walking through the hallway to get to my room you know in the hotel or whatnot since this morning <laughs> it it just has like the lingering smell of a really bad bean burrito in the hallway. It it doesn't smell right. Like I don't I don't know what that's about, but it doesn't it doesn't smell. I, ugh, I'm not I'm not a fan of bad bean burrito. I'm not a fan of bean burritos. Period. To be honest with you. Hey. So all right. I have just finished editing a vlog. Uploaded it. It's there. Go watch it. All that jazz. Um, I have had a bit of a night. It is officially 9.19. Um, I think I should go a little bit early simply because it's an hour difference and for whatever reason for me, you know, this makes me feel like a weenie. I am a weenie. And for me, that hour, it makes a difference. I, I can't really explain it, but it definitely makes a fucking difference, especially in my sleep. And know something about me I like my sleep I am not too much of a morning person but I like my sleep and if I don't get enough sleep I'm gonna send me grumpy son of a bitch in the morning and I'm not a fan of that so I think this is where I just kind of cut it off and say good night because tomorrow I have 
a lot more learning to do. That I'm actually looking forward to. That I actually factually am looking forward to that. I want to learn what I'm learning. It's um, one, it's part of my job, obviously. But I feel like it makes me that much more marketable in my arena that I, you know, in my job, the arena that I'm in, the whole nine yards. So I'm, I'm, I'm excited to learn. You know, try to soak up as much as I can, be a sponge. But that being said, I'm out of here. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.